Hi Nursery and Reception. Today we're going to be doing some counting. How many balls do you think there are all together? Can you estimate how many you think there are? Do you think it's more than one? I think so. Do you think it might be more than ten? I'm just going to guess. I think there might be 100. What do you think? Okay, let's see how many balls I can get into the bucket. Are you ready to start counting with me? Okay. Remember, you only say the number if I get it into the box, otherwise you wait for the next one. Ready? Okay, I'm gonna keep on trying and see if I can get even more than 10. How many do you think I can get this time? Okay, let's see if I can get even more than 10 this time. Are you ready? Here we go. One. Ah, uh, missed. So keep on trying. Fifteen is one of our mean teens. Look at it walking around with its stick. Okay, this time we're going to change the rules. We're going to pick a number and then I'm going to count out that many balls. So what number shall we pick? Let's go for number eight. Now remember, when we're counting out from a bigger group, when we get to the number we want, we stop counting. Ready? One, two, three. to stop. Oh, should we start all over again? This time, when I get to number eight, you have to say, stop! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, stop! I wonder if any of the reception children know any bigger numbers that are more than ten. Let's go for number 12. Number 12 is one of our mean teens again, isn't it? It's a 1 and a 2. Look at that number 12 walking around with its stick. Number 12 is extra mean, isn't it? That's because it wants you to say 2 teen. But we're not going to say that, are we? We're going to say 12. So don't let it trick you. Okay, so I need to get 12 balls into the box. Remember, when I get to number 12, you have to say, stop. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. say 
to number 12. Thank you for your help. How about number 16? Okay, so I need your help because 16 is a big number and it's one of our mean teens. So you need to really help me and really concentrate on counting all the way up to 16. So remember when I get to number 16, you have to say stop. Make sure you're counting with me. We're not going to go fast because we don't want to get confused. So we're going to count slowly and carefully. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This time, I'm not going to tell you what number we're going to count to. So it's your job to look really carefully and count how many balls I throw into the box. But we have to count slowly and carefully. I'm not going to tell you the number. You have to count. How many balls did I get into the box? Who counted? Can you say the number? That's right, it was nine. Okay, here we go. Can you say the number? It was 15 again. Well done if you said 15 too. Okay, let's have one more go. Let's see who can count really carefully one number each time the ball goes into the box. You ready? Okay, let's go. Stop! How many do you think there are in there? Let's check. Let's see if you were right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 18, 19 and 
20. That was a big number. Good counting, nursery and reception. Remember, it's not me counting this time, it's you counting. So you have to count really carefully one number every time the ball goes into the box. How many balls do you think I threw into the box? Here's how we can check. We can count them again to make sure. So keep that number in your mind. Let's count them together this time and let's see if you were right. Count with me this time. One, two, three, four, number 18 if you did well done that was really good counting that was some really good counting nursery and reception very well done if you're at home and you want to do some counting there are lots of things you can find around the house that you could count how about some potatoes or you could count how many felt tips or pens you've got or you could count some eggs, but it's probably not a very good idea to throw the eggs. So if you want to play a throwing game, maybe you could use your crayons or a ball or a bean bag.